Hi guys, Megan Britton 46 here, and welcome to the gameplay of Star and Marco from Star Bruce Sports of Evil playing the saga of Five Nights at Freddy. It's just doing this for fun for Halloween. So, I just want to say to you all, happy Halloween and enjoy the show. What the heck was that? Oops. <laughs> I thought you wanted a little danger. Hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise Star. you'll be a lot more hey, interesting this time. I am on the phone! Great you are so rude! You're out tracking down as You're right. right now. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place opens, people will come in at the opposite end of the building and work their way toward you and past you and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be starring as... a security guard! So not only will you be monitoring the people on the camera as they pass through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything or makes out in the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me tell you about what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and a foxy head, which we think could be authentic. Then again, it might just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school, metal though. Watch the fingers. Uh, <laughs> uh, right now the place is basically just, you know, flashing lights and spooky props. But uh, I honestly thought we'd have more by now. Uh, if we don't have something really cool by next week, so we may have to suit you up in a furry suit and make you walk around saying, Boo! <laughs> uh, but, you know, like I said, we're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings says it was like an extra room that got boarded up or uh, something like that. So we're going to take a peek and see what we can find. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with the new setup. Um, you can check the security cameras over to your right with the click of that blue button. Uh, you can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cam. Uh, then over to your far left, uh, you can flip up your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any systems that may go offline. <laughs> so in trying to make the place feel vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. <laughs> Some of this equipment is barely functional. Yeah, I wasn't joking about the fire. That's, that's, that's a real risk. Uh, the most important thing you want to watch for is the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spooks, man. And if you let that ventilation go off wide, then you'll start seeing some crazy stuff, man. Keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. Today we're learning how to channel our emotions. The Great Monster Massacre! Where no one can hear you scream. Surefire fun Hello. way to spice up a dull day. Hmm. Today might be the day I face my biggest fear. Boredom. Did you hear anything I just said? A little bit of banana, a little lot of magic. Star, I can't go now. And I'm not sure you have a firm enough grasp on Earth culture to go on your own. That crazy look in your eyes. What do you mean?
star, never go with a predator to a second location. Good luck did come your way. Quiet, Marco. This is serious. I was thinking of not dying. <laughs> I hate when you act like this. It makes me wonder why we're even friends. Uh. Hi. A big mistake. Ah! Are you okay? Yeah, totally, totally, totally. <laughs> 